Hi guys and welcome back to my channel and today we are going to be unboxing a brand new box of this channel and it is called Sugar Music so stay tuned. So like I said, we got a brand new box to the channel, a uh, brand new magical box, which I am very excited to get into, and it is called Sugar Muses, and this is the box right here. It is $53.99 a month, and I will leave down below in the description box about where to get it, how much it costs, and everything you need to know about this box. So let's open it up and see what's inside. Do open it up. It looks like this. Oh, look, it didn't drop on the floor. Yay. <laughs> so the first thing is an envelope and it's got a cute little sticker on it like that. So let's see if we can open it without ripping the sticker. Nope, I can't do it. I'm trying. Okay, kind of there. So this is, oh, it's an Oracle card. Oh, look at that. I like this deck. That is beautiful. Do you see that? I wonder what deck this is. I'm gonna have to look into it. Let's see, and this is the paper right here. And it's called Shadow Magic Solomon. But I don't wanna read it right now because I wanna see what's actually inside the box before it gives me spoilers to what's in the box. First thing I see is this beautiful artwork. Look at that, isn't that beautiful? It says which bottle. I can't wait to put this in my grimoire too. Oh, it's so pretty, look at that. I love it. And the next thing is a card on Samhain. Right there, isn't she pretty too? Another pretty card I can put in my grimoire. So very excited for that. So that is everything off the top. So we're gonna open her up. Oh, and you don't really see too much at all. So I do see their business card right there. So let's see what's inside this box. So the first thing I see, oh, it looks like a candle. So let's see, the plastic on it. So. Oh, and this is a Samhain ritual candle. Oh, it's got a cute little pumpkin on the top of it. Isn't that adorable? But there's the front of it right there. This candle is Dress in spell created to honor the energy of Samhain for use during shadow work to honor your ancestors. The candle is infused with dried dandelion, bay, cloves, frankincense, resin, and with clove and frankincense oils. A shaman tradition is to light a candle and place it on the west facing window to guide the spirits of loved ones to come back home. Oh, I love that. That's a great idea. So let's see what else is in this box. The next thing I see, oh, it looks like some potpourri. Oh, it smells really good too. So if you can see that. I don't want to open it because it's just all a bunch of different type of potpourri. Let's see, let's see what else we have here. It says it is lighty scented with notes of apple, pumpkin, citrus, clove, and nutmeg. When the scent fades, it can be refreshed with a few drops of your favorite oil. Thank the elements as well as other deities for their aid in contributing the energy of your spell ritual. If you have caught upon them, thank your ancestors for joining you if you also call upon them. So that's awesome. It smells so, so good. Let's see, let's see what's next in this box. Oh, that's cool. I see some matches right there. And then there's one side. So that's cool. I've never gotten matches before in a subscription box. Let's see, let's see what else is in here. Next, I see, oh, this not cute. Look at that. It's a bath bomb and it's a skeleton. Oh, that is adorable. I'm looking forward to using this. Let's see, let's see. Next we have, what's this missing? We have some Witchy Woman Ritual Oil right there. That is nice. I wanna see how much what it smells like. I don't really smell too much right now. I can smell so much other things. Let's see. Those anointing oils are a powerful means of dedicating yourself and your magical components with energies, correspondence to your intent. Next I see. Oh, it looks like a witch's bottle. Yep, it is. And there it is right there. That's cute. 
And then I also did see some witch bottle herbs. So I'm sure you would put the herbs inside the bottle. So let's read up a little bit about that. It says, witch bottles are a simple yet powerful form of folk magic and used to traditionally protect and deflect any curse of negativity. The first mention of witch bottle appears in the 17th century England and dates back to the 16th century of Europe. Some of the earliest docu documented witch bottles consist of stoneware. Later, the witch bottles were made from glass bottles, small glass vials, and variety of other containers. The witch bottle herbs to the bottle. Dry botanicals such as rosemary are considered powerful protection herbs. The blend contains woodworm, mugwort, bay, and rosemary. So that's cool. So let's see what else is in this. There's so many little spiders. The next thing I see is some apple cinnamon organic herbal tea right there. And then there is the bag. And it does come with a little tea bag as well. I'll try to smell it through because I don't want to open it because I have so many teas, but I'm excited to try this one. So. And the next thing I see right here, it looks like black obsidian, which is my favorite one of my favorite stones rose quartz is my favorite black obsidian just calls my name yep and that's what it is it's a rough cut of black obsidian this gemstone is said to be a powerful cleanser of your aura as many metaphysical properties that will protect you against negativity this is a very good stone for negativity but i will say this if you're holding on to this do not give this to someone else to hold on to because all the negative energy that you put inside this stone can go to somebody else and you don't want to give somebody else your negative energy so this is your stone your stone only so don't touch it so once you cleanse it it's yours so keep it on you like you can put it anywhere but don't give it to anybody else just a little you no know, the more you know so very excited so for some more black obsidian and next thing i see is oh this is cool is a book it's called the blood in bones working with shadow magic in the dark moon and this is an awesome book. I don't have this one. No, I do not have this book. Um, I'm looking actually really into it. It sounds amazing. So it says working with bones inside of it. Um, let's see, let's see. Uh, death candles, dark moon bath ritual, dark moon and scent recipes, how to invoke a deity. I don't know if I want to invoke a deity. Um, rules of the underworld so it definitely it looks definitely interesting so i'm looking forward to reading this because like i said i do not have this in my collection so let's just go over everything we got again we got the book we got the cute little spell candle we got the black um, obsidian we got the witch bottle and the witch bottle herbs we got the ritual oil we got some matches we got the cute little bath bomb, which I do like a lot. We got the incense and we got the tea in the tea bag. So I think that's everything. I didn't see anything else. Oh, I missed something in the box. And we have some incense right here too. Oh my gosh, that smells so good. And we have, let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six, eight incense sticks in this. And this smells so good. But that is everything that we did get in this month's box. Like I said, this is the first time I've ever gotten this box. So what do you guys think about it? Do you think I should still keep it up? Or, um, I do. I did sign up for it one more time for next month. So I'm curious to see what it will be like next month as well. I hope you guys subscribe to my channel and ring the bell. I hope you guys have a wonderful and a magical day. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye, guys.